hello and welcome back thanks for clicking on the video this is Nate and I have for you this super nice home made by Colony Homes it is a three bedroom two bath home comes in at 1493 square feet let me tell you the primary bathroom on this it's got a pretty unique layout can't say that I've seen one laid out like that. You got his and her closets. The kitchen has got the uh, really nice upgraded Thinsulate um, Center Island. And let's, uh, of course we have that really nice stonework we'll come back and take a look at. Give you a quick shot of the floor plan. Of course, we're gonna show that as we get ready to go into the home. So in case you haven't noticed, I am at the, you know, based on the ceiling and all that, we are at the 2024 Louisville Home Show. And let me tell you, there is a lot of really nice homes here. Y'all are going to want to stick around. I think there's even a couple of two-story homes. Take a closer look at the stonework and then we'll head on in. And I really like the way the black stands out from the white. So as we come in, you can see you've got the uh, eight and a half foot ceilings, really dark shiplap wall over here. That seems to be the trend that I've noticed this year is they've gotten with this really dark, almost black shiplap. I've seen that in a lot of homes so far. Good sized living room. Let's see if I can get in the corner over here. Give you one more shot. And then we'll come around. Look at how well lit that kitchen is. Here's that material I was talking about for your center island. Nice and thin, but really heavy duty, feels really solid. We have the white cabinets in the island in the dark almost black colored cabinets in the rest of the kitchen. Stainless steel Whirlpool appliances. Of course you got all your accessories in your sink. Turn. And that is a heavy cutting board. We have drawers above all our doors. You pull almost all the way out, soft close. This has the slanted glass hood. And they went with a gas stove in this one. Of course you can always get electric if that's what you want. It's 
get one cabinet up above. Lots of counter space in here. So now as we step back and take a look at your kitchen. A lot of cabinets, a lot of counter space. Really like the gold pulls. Now let's swing over this way before we go to the dining room. There's your microwave. And here's your pantry. Now this runs a full width of the home. I should say of a half section of the home. And now we will come down here to the dining room. Get the utility room after that. And into the utility room, we have our washer and dryer hookups with a cabinet to the side, rod on the, can be above your washer. And then there's our electrical panel. And now as we step on down, we have our furnace right past our dining room area. And then our drop zone with some linen storage. There's your back door. And this, I believe, if I'm, is the water heater. And then our guest bathroom. And look at the size of the tub they give you in your guest bathroom. And then both our bedrooms are going to be on this side of the home. Now I won't be able to show you the closet in this one. Because they've got a kind of bunch of stuff packed in front of it. And into bedroom number two. Now both your closets will be the same size in this home. So I can show you this one so you get an idea. Nice size closets. And I don't believe I showed you the coat closet. Then we have a very large primary bedroom. Kind of get an idea what the unique layout of that bathroom over there. Here is the first of the two closets.
You got the gold pulls on your cabinets and look at how many cabinets you have in this bathroom. It just goes and goes and goes. We got drawers at both ends and we have cabinets up above. And I think I found my new favorite mirror. Hello Raiden. These are the newer ones with the lights kind of, they stick out a little bit, but the LED lights circle the entire mirror instead of being built in like the square ones used to be. Speaking of square, we've got the square sinks. Then we've got our bench for sitting down, taking your shoes off, putting your shoes on, whatever else you need to do. Here is that second closet. Now this one is only gonna be about the size of what's in your guest bedrooms. And if you haven't noticed, they went with a different tie or a different flooring here in the bathroom versus the rest of the home. And there is your water closet. You have a window in the water closet. And then we had the window at the very end of our counter there and the large tile shower. So I hope you all will go down into the comment section down below and leave me a comment letting me know what you think of this home. Do you like the darker colors? Uh, would you like to see some lighter color cabinets? And uh, while you're there, don't forget to hit the like button, hit that subscribe button, turn on those notifications. That way you get notified when I upload videos. And I will be back shortly with some price information. Thanks for watching. All right, we are back for the pricing information yep <laughs> i know y'all want to know some price information so i'm going to try to keep this a little on the shorter side i got a bunch of videos to edit between now and thursday because i fly out friday morning to the biloxi home show so uh i got a bunch of work ahead of me here <laughs> but uh i know y'all want some price information on this one now the best i can do is give you an estimated retail price because this is at the louisville home show and uh, so we don't know where it's going to go. We don't know what freight charges are going to be, what city, county fees are going to be. Depending on the state that it's going to, it could be have to be built slightly different. So there's a lot of things to keep in mind for this. The estimated retail price for this is going to be between $145,000 to $155,000. So I hope you all enjoyed it. And if you like these homes from the Home Show, don't forget to check out this playlist over here. Or if you're looking for something about the same size, maybe check out this guy over here. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.